and I'm back with another video. I know y'all been waiting on this video, begging for it, all that. So I'm finally doing it for y'all after it took me like three weeks, three months, three years. Like y'all been waiting on this, and I said I'm doing it so many times, and I actually did do it, but I ended up deleting it on accident. So after that, I was just like forget. But now that I have time, I'm gonna break all that. I'm gonna do it for y'all. I promise. I promise I was gonna do it for y'all, so I'm doing it. So the first gel I have is Gorilla Snot. And I love it like, there's nothing bad about this product, like I just love it. Now I don't like the yellow one at all, but this one, it's good like, and then it lasts a long time, like a little goes a long way, so. This is definitely a good gel or edge control, whichever one, like, you can use it as a gel or edge control, which is why I love it. Like, sometimes I run out of a gel, and then I'll be like, hey, I got some gorilla snot, put that all on my ponytail, use it on my edges as well, and I'm good to go, like, this is good, so y'all should definitely get this. Next one I got is the Less Gel Extra Hold. And this is real good, like, keeps my hair laid. But it's this, like, jam doesn't get hard at all. Like, that's why I love jam over, like, other type of gels. So, I used this one time, and people were like, who still uses jam? Who still uses jam? Like, I didn't know people still use that, but I use it. I don't care. If you work on my hair, I'm going to use it, period. So, yeah, y'all should definitely get this. Bringing it back since people got stuff to say about it. Who still uses it? Bring it back because this definitely works. It works very good. Next, I got the regular hole. And if I had to choose, I would definitely choose the extra hole because I mean, it's extra hole. Why wouldn't I? But I use this like when I'm doing like simple ponytails or pineapples. And I don't need a lot of gel or product on my hair, just for like simple hairstyles. So, yeah. Both of them smell really good. I love them. So this is the um, MC7 Wax Stick. And they actually sent me this from Instagram, the company. You can look them up and order some if you want. It works really good. It's like a stick. Push it up. And then you just get the waxing on your hair. And it actually holds it like this is some good stuff and it doesn't have like a strong smell at all it just smells like you can't really smell nothing and i like that so this is very good so y'all should definitely check them out and try their products because i love it next i got this eco styler coconut oil my favorite gel of all time like out of every gel i've used this is my favorite one because it don't flay, it don't make my hair hard, like, I just love it, I love how it looks, like, mine's empty, so you can't see how it looks, but it's like, it's glittery looking, I love it, like, this is my favorite, so, y'all should get this, like, I know a lot of people haven't tried this one, so y'all should definitely get this, like, and tell me how it works for y'all, because this one, works so well on my hair it's the bomb like this is my favorite gel i can't stress it to y'all it's my favorite one next one i got is the organ or one organ 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 i got the organ i got the organ oil one okay and this one makes my hair hard, but it doesn't flake. Like, all the other Eco Stylers, except these two, make my hair flake. Like, the green one and all the other ones, they make my hair flake. This one makes my hair hard, but it doesn't flake. So, I still love this one, but it's, it don't got nothing on this one, baby. Like, it don't. So, y'all should definitely try both of these out, because they're good. Next, I got my Jiraki Edge Control Banana Stance. And this smells so good. It keeps my hair looking soft, but at the same time, holding it. Like, 
most of that hard your hair makes it hard but this one it leaves my edges feeling soft like oh and that still feels soft like what girl i love this i love this like hair products make me so happy like i can shop for hair products all day like every time i go to the store i gotta go look in the hair product section like i can not even buy nothing just staring there like i want this like i love hair products so this is really good if y'all want to try this out they got banana scent i think they have strawberry orange all that so y'all should definitely try i'm gonna leave their name down there next i got the coconut oil hair and scalp conditioner grease and i use this just to um condition my scalp when it's really dry because i do have dry scalp and like it gets flaky sometimes do i got something in my hair and it get flaky sometimes so i do use this just to keep my scalp conditioned next i got the mc7 collection mc7 collection edge control and it smells good it's just like a clear color which you can't tell because it's in this black packaging but this is definitely the bomb. I love it. It's, it's very similar to um this extra troll I'm going to show y'all next. They're very similar. Like, they're just alike, really. So, I mean, they're not really different at all. Like, they're the same. The thing I have to say about both of these, though, is it's hard for me to do my edges once I apply it on my hair, like, I can apply it and then it'll be like hard to swoop it in the direction I want to swoop it in and all that. So I'm not really feeling these two edge controls. I mean, I have to force my edges with this and I don't like that because when I have to force something, it don't come out right. So, I mean, a lot of people like these. A lot of people love this one especially. But me, I'm not a big fan of it. So, yeah. On to my shampoo. Now I got the Coconut Milk Nourishing Shampoo from Bella Curls, y'all. I love it. My hair be smelling so good. Y'all gotta get this, like, y'all gotta get it. My hair be feeling so soft. It just feel like a bunch of waves. Like, it just feel like you're in the ocean. Like, your hand is going swimming. Like, my hair be feeling so good. And I love this. I love it. It's a very underrated product, like. A lot of people are not on Bella Curls, and I feel like more people should try it because it's very good. Next, I got the Parnaboo Tea Tree Shampoo. And this is just an old shampoo that was sitting in my, um, my closet. So, I don't really use it anymore. So, I can't say, like, if I really like it because I haven't used it in so long, but... I'm just showing y'all, just in case y'all want to try. Y'all want to know what I use, so I'm showing y'all or what I have. So next, I got the Cantu um, cleansing cream shampoo, and I do not use Cantu products at all anymore. Just to let y'all know, they really dry my hair out, and I'm not feeling it like at all. So. Next, I got the Maintain by Dollar Curl Club Hydrating Gentle Cleanse Shampoo. And I just got this and I used it once. And I love it. Like, it doesn't make, you know how you can wash your hair with some shampoos and after you wash it, it just feels so dry and like all your moisture is gone. But this actually helps. Like, my hair still feels like it has its oils and all that in it. It's oils and it's natural minerals and all that. So, yeah. I love this. Next is on to my oil. This is the Cantu Shea Butter Tea Tree Jojoba. Tea Tree and Jojoba Hair and Scalp Oil. And it conditions scalp to encourage growth and helps protect against breakage. Like I said, I don't use Cantu anymore, but when I first started transitioning back, 
I was using K2 like crazy, like, and I loved this at the time, but once you try other products, you're like, mm-mm, like, I can't. So, yeah, I wasn't really feeling this, but, I mean, I was feeling it at first, but I'm not feeling it now, so, I don't really, I'm not on K2 anymore. Next, I got the Silky Castor Hair Oil, and I haven't even tried this yet, but I'm just showing y'all, like I said. Y'all can't even see it, bro. Next, I got my Coconut Water Replenishing Treatment Mist. And this is good for on the go. You don't have to do a little dry. You can just... Let me, let me spray a little bit. Ooh. And it gives it like a mist, and it just feels hydrated. Like, this is why I love it. And it smells so good. Like... This is just on the go. Like, you can keep this in your purse. You know you're that type of person. Where your hair stay dry. Keep this in your purse. On the go. You just spray a little bit. Girl, your hair gonna be feeling hydrated. Looking good. Like, woo. So, this is very good for y'all. Very good. Oh, I love it. That's good. Next, I got the Nourishing Herbal Hair Oil from Maintained by Dollar Curl Club. And this is good as well. I just like to keep my scalp moisturizer oils and greases and all that. So, Next, I got Hair and Beard Magic. This is like a spray to promote growth. And this is by Best Hair Care Solutions. I got this from Instagram also. Off of Instagram. So yeah, that's very good. Most of these products I have are very good products. Like I haven't came across a lot of bad products, but this is very good product. Next I got some vitamins, some gummy vitamins, y'all. These things are so good. Like I can eat them like they're real candy. So y'all need to try this. Okay, now I got the Mercy Hair Vitamins. Ooh, my back itching. I got the Mercy Hair Vitamins Vegan Friendly Gummies. Vitamin hair gummies that promote growth and healthy hair. I didn't take none of this, so I'm finna take them right now. But look. Yes, don't let it look good. I'm gonna order me some more. We got two left. That's one more day. These are good. Okay, on to my conditioners. I got the three minute miracle moist. You keep it in for three minutes. Deep conditioner. I don't use this anymore because they said they have like alcohol and stuff in them. Alcohol and What's it called? Sulfates and all that. So I don't use this anymore. But. I tried it. I didn't like it when I tried it though. Because. My hair just felt very dry. Mm -mm. Next I got the Bella Curls Curl Defining Cream. And I use this to get my curls defined. Like if I do a twist out. Or a wash and go. I do use this. And my curls be looking good. Like, what? So, yeah. Next, I got the Kuza Naturals Jamaican Black Castor Oil Repair Cream Leave-In Conditioner. And it smells so good. I love it. Like, I love it. I was using this so much when I first started transitioning. And it's like, this is really the only product I started using when I was transitioning that I still use today. Like, So, this is a good product. Next, I got the Coconut Hair Milk by Jaquila. Next, I got the Maintained by Dollar Curl Club Hydrating Detangling Conditioner. 
And I do use this when I detangle my hair because who wants their hair all stuck together looking like dreadlocks? Like, and this helps because I used to detangle my hair without anything and it just hurts and it's painful and it's just too much work. But this helps a lot. So I recommend this product to all of y'all natural girls out there. Y'all know what we go through trying to calm our hair out and separate our curls. It's a lot of work. And that makes it a lot easier. Next, I got the tea tree leave-in conditioner by Parnaville again. Like I said, I haven't used these, like this name brand in a long time. So, I can't really tell y'all. But, next, I got the Good Butter Curl Pop Buttercream Pie. It smells just like buttercream pie, which is why it's called that. Man, I'm trying to show y'all, but it don't look like it smells just like buttercream pie, like banana pudding, all that. It just smells so good. And it's a good moisturizer and curl definer as well, so I love it. Next, I got the Maintain by Dollar Curl Club Curl Defining Cream, and this is a good curl defining cream as well. Just because I need some curl definers, because I know I be needing some. So that's a good product. Next, I have Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Leave In Conditioning Cream. And I'm not really a big fan of it. Like, it made my hair so dry and just crunchy, and I hate it. Like, I hate Cantu. Like, ugh. I don't know why I was so in love with them at first. Probably because I know nothing about hair products, but. I don't like them. Next, I got the Cream of Nature Creamy Oil Moisturizer Hair Lotion. And this is good as well, but I don't really use it anymore. Like, Cream of Nature and Kentu, I'm not big fans of at all, but they're okay. Well, Cream of Nature is okay. Next, I got the leave-in conditioner by Maintain by Dollar Curl Club again. Their products are really good to me. Like, I love Dollar Curl Club products. They're really good. Next, I got Cantu Rinse Out Conditioner, which made my hair so dry and just... I can't even describe it to y'all how it just made my hair feel. Like, after you wash your hair and stuff, it's supposed to feel fresh and just good and smooth and all that good stuff and my hair felt filthy and dry and just I couldn't take it next I got the Bella Curls leave in conditioner and it's coconut whipped cream too girl I love Bella Curls products my hair my curls be the fine I think I'm gonna do um like a tutorial for y'all showing y'all like me defining my curls with all their products just so y'all can see that I'm not joking about this like their products are so good next I got the best hair care solutions lights moisturizing cream and I use all of this it's really greasy like but that's it it's for growth moisture strength and shine Ooh. And that's it. So, y'all, these are all my products. I hope y'all enjoy. I hope y'all like. Tell me what y'all want next. All that good stuff. I have a lot more coming for y'all. So, make sure y'all subscribe. And I love y'all. And thanks for just watching me so far and being here from the beginning. Because when I tell y'all big things are coming, big things are coming.